very rare bird here, this custom Powell trumpet. It's so versatile, it's so much fun, and uh, I'm excited to have one. We haven't had many Powell trumpets come in to the shop, so I'm excited to do this video and tell you a little bit more about it. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, how you doing? It's Trent Austin from Austin Custom Brass. Hope you're having a fantastic day out there. Please make uh, sure you hit the subscribe button, stay up to date with us. Sorry if you hear some construction noise in the background. We are actually expanding our shop. We're very fortunate. Thanks to all of your amazing support. Uh, we are so thankful for you. Um, so you might hear some construction noises in the background, um, and I apologize. But I wanted to get this uh, horn video done because we just launched this product. It is a great trumpet. I don't know if you know uh, a lot about Powell trumpets. They're made by Fred Powell, who lives in Elkhart, Indiana. I have known Fred since 19... <laughs> Uh, actually, uh, I worked at Disney uh, one summer, and I had a Lawler trumpet made for me, and Fred was very instrumental in helping me get that trumpet made. It was actually my first foray into custom trumpets, and little did I know that I'd end up doing uh, what I'm doing now. But it, uh, Fred was so positive and kind and really an amazing uh, voice to bounce ideas back and forth from. He's had his own company for many years and makes awesome trumpets. This trumpet is um, very straight down the middle for him. This one is got, uh, a, as you can see, like a higher copper content bell, if you look at that, versus the, the mouth pipe. One thing you want to check out that it's just so gorgeous, and he hand makes all of these trumpets. Um, the block is from the Blessing of Pro Series, and it's an amazing block. I actually have another horn that we're selling called the Bless Burn, which I'm thinking about keeping. It's a Blackburn trumpet with a Blessing valve block, and it's so good. Um, but I love the trim of his valves. Check that out. Isn't that amazing? It's old school craftsmanship at its best. Really beautiful. Single braced tuning slide, semi round crook, dual Saturn water keys. But the bracing between the bell and the lead pipe, you gotta check this out. Look how gorgeous that is. And especially look at the footing here. See that? Real, that's a real hard brace to make. Now, most people go, oh, it's a brace, it's not a big deal. These are nickel, they're hand fit. I'm sure it takes a long time to, to do the footing and, um, and placement of this brace. This bell is one of Fred's all around bells, he told me. And it's, like I said, a little bit higher in, in red brass content. Um, beautiful, beautiful horn. Uh, and in great shape. It really plays just so great. And it's super versatile. You can play anything you want on this. So I did a little bit of uh, Out of Nowhere and then right into Hindemith. But if I wanted to play an orchestral excerpt, I could do it as well on this. Check it out.
been a minute since I played that on B flat trumpet, but very nice. The the uh, evenness of this horn is just wonderful. Check out the the connections between slurs. I could tell a lot about a horn's efficiency by doing things like that. And of course, yeah, people go, well, you could make everything sound good. And yeah, there's a lot of to be said about the operator of the of the vehicle, right? But I could tell you when a horn doesn't want to work, there's it takes more effort. So it's really hard to, to convey that over a camera, per se, about the efficiency factor. But this horn is super efficient. I love the cleanliness of it. Sometimes you get the cleanliness without the depth of sound, though. You don't have that balance. A horn could be really crisp and, and precise and really zingy, but it lacks the core to play a ballad. This horn has beautiful core. I think that's partly due to the higher copper content in the red brass bell. It really is a delight to play. Very, very good horn. And that's with our our three plus, basically. It's an acrylic version of the three of the custom reserve. Um, there'll be a link for the custom reserve in the description if you don't know the new custom reserve line that we're doing. But I'll put our our L3 plus lead mouthpiece in. I don't know if you can see that. Let me see if I can get it a little closer. This is awesome because this horn will light up and be very crisp and clean in the upper register. So just an awesome all-around trumpet. This is the Powell that we have for sale. There'll be a link in the description. Click it. Check it out. More pictures and details on this beautiful trumpet. It won't last long because it's such a good horn. Click that link right there. Stay up to date with us. And thanks so much for your great support of ACV. Cheers.